got up day. Hold up, I got up day. I to be a lot of last. What's the other? I could be a lot of you. I I I Come back to life. Oh, my dear. Are you trying to disgrace me? I say, come back to life. I, Otitiko, who traversed the seven deadly seas and the seven deadly forests, arms cut it. I am saying, come back to life. If you don't come back to life this moment, my dear, I will have no choice than to return you to ordinary earth and keep my honor. Why should I go through all these problems, all these troubles for your sake? Come back to life. Sufaya Gina, we are here already. 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 We are Come! 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 Hey! It's a lie! My God, I'm having it! The son of a lion does not eat grass! Hey, 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 hey! I got him one he done, then I walk with you. I go and do it. I go to the blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Sophia. Sophia. You are Tortoise. And Tortoise, you shall remain. Hey, go back to where you belong. Tortoise.
Welcome to the land of the living, Sophia. Welcome, my daughter. <laughs> Where is he? Where is I that evil man? Him. I have finished him. I, Ochitiko, who dines and wines with all the deadly gods and spirits of the universe of land and sea, I have finished him. Come, my daughter. Fear no more. This time, I shall fortify you against all odds. And no man born of a woman shall ever try to. Sorry, Nai. I, I don't want to be part of this again. What? I'm sorry, Nai. I, I saw myself going into hell. I, I don't need the powers again. Do you know what you are saying? It means you are going to lose everything. Your money, your houses, your cars. Is that what you want? But, but Nai, what would I want? What would I lose? Uh... All right. Um... Well, let me go and think about it, I... Yes, go and think about it and make your choice quickly and let me know. Don't forget that Otichipo is the greatest of them all. The one who is mandated to represent all the deadly gods and spirits of the universe of land and sea. I have seen many die, but still live it. No one looks between my eyes and sees good. No one! <laughs> You can go. Thank you, Nai. Ha 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 It's a pity. She doesn't know that no one abandons Ostiko. And knows no peace. Jennifer? Yeah. Mm. I dealt with her big time. I trust you. She girl. can't come near Sophia with a 10 foot pole. Hey, you mean you people are still fighting your battle? She cannot fight me. I know you now, <laughs> Sophia. You are a conqueror. Bless you, my dear. You know, you know, I, I, uh, Lagos became too hot for me. Oh. I decided to relocate to Abuja and chill, you know? <laughs> you know I've been telling you to come to Abuja, but you have been dilly-dallying, you know? This is the time. <laughs> Welcome to Bless Abuja, my right dear. Look at that lepa over there. That's the type chief I did the delight, you know. Let's see. Mm -hmm. What's her name? Um, let me see. I think she's a new student on campus. Adesu Odie. That's her name. Adesu Odie. I see that fatty bum bum over there. That, <laughs> that is for Alaji Dashika. 
He likes them fat and big, you know. You know the Yoruba size. Uh -huh. <laughs> what is her name? Um, let me see. Yeah, I think she's one of the best students too. Look at that shine, shine one. I think that would be good for Senator Oko. Uh, yeah, yes, yes, yes. She's okay, but she not too fine. You think it's not fine? Wait, concern Senator Oko, some concern fine. I mean, she just is shine, wara, wara, nine like. <laughs> I beg, wait till be her name. Check, check, check. <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Oh, I think we've gotten enough. Please, let's go. I need to come Enough. Hmm. These ones that we just shortlisted now, hmm. they are for offshore. Mm -hmm. After the dinner party, they will take the next available flight the next morning back to Lagos. Hmm. The ones I want to shortlist now, they are for onshore. Hmm. After the dinner party, they will stay with them in their rooms for two weeks. That is where the money is. Hmm. Caro, Caro. Onshore, offshore contractor. My dear, <laughs> don't forget that we need strong guys, you know, with muscles. <laughs> no, you're taking this business seriously. Mm -hmm. And you know, time you just be a don in Abuja, we are looking at you. Do I have a choice? All my life, I've avoided doing genuine business. Mm. And it almost cost me my life. Look. <laughs> that is where that stupid woman shot me. Hmm. And it's by the grace of God that I'm alive today. The doctor said the bullet missed my heart by just a millimeter. Hi. God, I thank you. Thank God, though. I really thank God, though, my dear. That is why I'm into this journey business, you know. I'm sure you know. I'm not just the one small, small, small. Right on. Right on. Um, that guy, I'm gone. I will need him for... Don't worry, I'll tell you later. <laughs> Do you know his name? Rose Efe, just come over here. Your tickets. Thank you. Um, Kate Soji. Yes, ma'am. And Jane Odo. Yes, ma'am. Your tickets. You girls should conduct yourself very well when you get to Abuja. You'll be meeting with top men that rule this country and not your fellow hungry students. Hmm? Yes. You girls should treat them very nicely without no reservation. Do you understand what I mean? Yes, yes ma'am. Any one of you that messes up will not be part of this trip next time. No, next month's trip to London. Do I make myself clear? Yes, Do you have any question? I hope we can make it back early enough on Monday. I have a text for 10 a.m. What is your name? Irene Aleke. Hi. Rain. Huh? Rain. Okay. Can I have my ticket back? Ah, I'm sorry. Let my, me please. have my ticket. Since you will go there and talk about your test. No sense is this. Carol, just forgive her. She'll adjust, I'm sure. Let me not hear this nonsense from any one of you. You think business is easy? If only you know what it takes to survive as a working class lady, then you girls would appreciate what I'm trying to do for you. Eh? Go on, wait in the, in the bus. We're already late for the last flight. I'll join you. Let me get something inside. Take them to the bus. Get to the bus. Just a little present for a wonderful darling. 
journey. Why not even stop bothering yourself with gifts and presents? Senator, how do you expect me to be tired? I owe you my life. If not for your influence, I will still be rotting away in that jail. No, 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 darling. Not my influence at all. Yes, the law naturally took its course. Yes, I hired the senior advocate to defend you. Yes. But the appeal court declared you innocent. And that's all. <laughs> anyway, you look at it, Senator. I know that it was your influence and, of course, your connections. All right, Jenny, if you insist. But I'll tell you something that is right behind us. I don't really look forward to greater things between us, okay? Okay. All right, Jenny. So. What do we have here? Ta -da! This is beautiful, Jenny. You like it? Oh, I love it. <laughs> this is... And I am going to hang it conspicuously there. <laughs> decided to do now, darling. You know, Senator, I've been thinking, and I think that after all this trauma, I should get myself involved in a decent business. Not contracts. No. I'm no longer prepared for the witch hunting and hustling involved in contracts. No more for me. So, what have you arrived at? to be in a position to award such contracts. Oh yeah? I want a government appointment where I can award contracts and collect my percentage neatly and nicely. <laughs> <laughs> Senator, I hope you don't think that I'm being over ambitious. Uh, no, not at all. On the contrary, your kind of ambition gives me the kicks. How oh, do you think I love you so much? Really? Hmm? Uh, i tell you the truth. You are right on time. You heard me correctly. You are right on time. Yes, the Honorable Minister for Sports and Youth Development told me last week that his ministry is appointing coordinating officers for the youth development program. And what he needs are energetic, good looking and intelligent young women like you. Coordinating officers? That's right. That sounds really good. Mm -hmm. sounds good. You see, <clears throat> This government is pumping a lot of funds into that ministry to encourage and empower the youth, especially the women. Talk to me, sir. Yes, honey, I'll give you a note to the Honorable Minister tomorrow. Mm. You have to be very careful with that man. He is very, very randy. Really? Very, very randy. You know, Senator. And for no one else but you. So I got one.
this matter? Blackmail? Criminal? Wonder what she's doing here? Thought I was true with such devils. She's actually going in there. Why is she following me around? Oh well. I'm not bothered. What I did to her in Lagos is small. Now, I am going to show her the real Abuja connection. Rubbish. Well, coming from Senator Brendan, I cannot deny you a position. But the problem is that the list for the national coordinators is already filled up. We needed only 10 ladies, which was filled just about five minutes before you entered. But what I can do for you is to pencil down your name as one of the state coordinators. Sorry, Honorable Minister. Did you say that um, the list was filled up minutes before I came in? Precisely. But why did you ask? Hmm. I just hope it's not what I'm thinking about. What is it that you're thinking about? I saw someone I know way back in Lagos as I drove into the premises. And I just hope she's not the one because that would be tragic. What exactly are you talking about and what is tragic about the person? Honorable Minister, her name is Sophia Judge. Take it from me, she's into witchcrafts, sorcery and magic. She can change into a snake or a wild animal of any sort and attack near about anybody and that includes you. Just say it's her name. Sophia Judge. It's her all right, isn't it? Honorable Minister, I am not saying this so you can replace her name with mine. No, not at all. I'm saying this for your safety and the safety of this project. If you bring her into this project, she'd use a sorcery and magic and confuse everybody here and embezzle all the funds for the whole project. And I'm sure you know the implication of that, Honorable. Are you sure of what you are talking about? I am certain. You can make your inquiries. Make more investigations, especially in Lagos. Sophia Judge is a hardened, wanted household criminal name in Lagos. Take it from me on good authority. Believe. Hello, madam. My name is Sophie George. I'd like to speak with the minister. Yes, he's expecting my call. Yes, in connection with my appointment as co-coordinator youth empowerment. Okay. Okay, okay. It's all right. Get her connected on the line, okay? Honorable Minister, this is Sophia George. I'd like to thank you for my appointment. And I want to confirm 
you know, the meeting of the appointees for Friday. Man, it's all right. It's all right. That's okay. Okay. Um, but okay, okay. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, uh, so sorry, sir. But she sound withdrawn. Is there any problem? Um, not exactly. But call me back Thursday morning for the final ratification of your appointment before the meeting. I thought everything was settled yesterday. What other confirmation do I need? Less than young lady. You don't have any right or ground to question the modus operandi of my ministry. Every appointment is subject to final confirmation before the inauguration of the council. I understand, sir. I am sorry. I am not trying to question your ministry, just that I... It's okay, it's alright, it's alright. Just call me back on Thursday morning as I advised. Have a nice day. Sir, hello? Hello? How was your day? My day was fine. Obviously yours wasn't fine. What happened? That which has destroyed all I have worked for in that ministry. Jennifer, your arch enemy. What connection does she have with the job you found at the ministry? I met Jennifer at the minister's office. She actually walked into the minister's office. What for? Sophia George cannot tell. But I knew something was going to go wrong the moment I saw her there. I made a call to the ministry this morning to confirm my appointment. What do I get? The minister was, I mean, he sounded hostile, saying things like, my appointment needs to be ratified. You know, I can't question their ministry or his authority. And such crap! Did you dig deep and you concluded it was Jennifer that did it? Lisa, I don't need a soothsayer to tell me. Can you imagine the minister even honk the phone on me? What? <sighs> Sophia, you sound helpless when it comes to this Jennifer of a girl. Who the hell is she? Can't you stop her from destroying your life? Can't you? Ah. Oh. Helpless? I, Sophia George, helpless. <laughs> ah, Lisa, even you don't seem to know me. Just you wait. I'm going to mend Jennifer once and for all. Sophia, you know what? We will go to that ministry tomorrow. And if I find out that Jennifer has a hand in this, just leave the case to me. I will deal with her in my own way. I will show her who actually the dumb is in this Abuja capital city. Let me go and undress. Listen up, girl. She's not a problem. We will deal with her. Honorable lies you told the Honorable Minister, you better trust them. 
else, I will show you that this is Abuja and not Lagos. Blackmailer! Okay. I own the dawn here. This is my territory, my zone. What can you do? Just she's watch. asking us what, what we are we going do? to do. Ah! Murderer! How dare you! Ah! And so you had fights in public, in an honorable minister's office. Listen, Jenny, I think you are a lady with class and dignity. But whenever it comes to this, what do you call her, Sophia, or whatever her name is, Sophia. you strip yourself of all dignity and respect. How she found her way to Abuja really beats me. The honorable minister called me and thanked me for sending a mad dog to his office. Why? How could you do this to me? Huh? Why? Senator, I'm truly sorry. Please. I'm even ashamed of myself. Yes, I am. This sort of embarrassment will never happen again. Believe me. Please. Please believe me. Please. Just tell me. What is it with this Sophia? What is it? Senator, I don't want to bother you with the details. It goes way back. I'm, I'm sorry, believe me. Now that I've lost this golden opportunity due to my stupidity, what else can I be engaged in? I mean, I'm depending on you like I've always done. And you've never failed me anyway. So where do I go from here? <laughs> I think I know where you should go from here. You do? <laughs> oh, you're a darling. Since I've known you, you've always been a fighter, a dogged fighter, a go-getter. But like the chicken, I think it is time to roost. I don't understand you, Senator. You mean I should stay idle, doing nothing? Mm. Maybe I should put it more directly. 
journey once again i am proposing to you marry me and i'll take very good care of you you don't have to work so hard like you've been doing or struggle as you used to do you know and then you keep me company for the rest of my life i'm sorry senator i i can't marry you Why are you rejecting me, Jenny? No, Senator. I'm not rejecting you. I can't reject you. Not after all you've done for me. Then marry me. Okay, let's put it this way. Um, I will think about it. And then I'll give you my feedback by the weekend. Okay? Are you sure? Of course. I cross my heart. Then make sure that your response is positive. Okay? Yes. I have always thought about you and I in our private yacht going around the world. There's, there's enough money. You understand? Or would you want us to have a private jet? Jenny, I think you should accept this proposal. My dear, he has done so much for you to deserve you as his wife. After all, his wife is late. His kids are abroad. Nay, you can have him all to yourself. Hmm? Carol, don't you think I know all that? Of course I know all that. But I also know something that you don't know. And what would that be? I'm not meant for marriage. Oh, come off it. Yes, Carol. It's true. I knew it since I was nine years old. It was even confirmed by prophets and seers. They said that my mother, she sought my birth from some river goddess. And because of that, I am married to one spirit husband in some sea. But of course, I didn't believe all that. So, I forgot all about it after a while. But guess what? What? I've ended up in disasters ever since then. Come on, Jenny. It wasn't your fault. It was the fault of that stupid Sophia and her necromancy. Her juju. Eh? That's the one that you know. But let me tell you something. My first marriage ended up even in a worse disaster. Your first marriage? You mean you were married before? Yes, Carol. For four horrible years, I met this man. Or should I say, he met me in my third year in the university. He was very rich, but I didn't like him at all. But he was so persistent throwing his money all about. And you know now, after a while I persuaded myself to marry him, hoping that I'll get to love him with time. But of course, the reverse was the case. The moment I married him, Carol, seeing him every day, the little love I had for him, or the little likeness I had for him, flew out the window. Carol, Carol, Benjamin saw hell in my hands. all this now. Hmm? I thought we did this thing last week. Can't we just rest for this week? Rest for this week? How bad, Jenny? How 
Bah, listen to yourself. Married couples do this thing, especially newly married ones. They do it every other day. Huh? Every day? Yes. It's a sign of love. A sign of love between married couples. Please, count me out. Me, I come from a decent family where things are done in moderation. But what has your family got to do with this? This is the love between a husband and a wife. Baby, come, give it to me, please. Please. Come. What is this? Ah, please, Benji, it's like you won't let me sleep. Hmm. And, and where do you think you're going? To my room, of course. Where else? If you are a sex maniac, please, oh, me, I'm not. Like, what's happening now? Mm -hmm. Let's go to the bedroom. Yeah, I've told you. I don't have strength. Let's keep it tomorrow. You don't have strength. But Sly, what's happening? You're getting tired too early these days. Are you sure you're not seeing another woman? Ah, mm -hmm. How can you say a thing like that? You know that I'm not seeing any other woman except you. So why? What? Must we be doing this in everything? So you don't know? You don't know that we're supposed to be doing it three times in a day, eh? We're supposed to do it in the morning before you go to work. Then at lunch break, you come back, we do it. Then in the night, we do it again. But because I'm married, I'm waving the night session for you and you're still complaining. Come on, get up, please. Please, let's keep it to tomorrow, please. So you are tired, eh? Yeah, we'll see. Okay now, let's go and rest. You said you are tired. Yes. So let's go and rest. Are you sure we're going to rest? Yes, we're going to are rest. Are you sure of that? Yes, we're going to rest. Yes. <laughs> let's go and Just rest. Just to go and rest too. Yes, to go and rest. I won't sell. Why you have a queen like me in the house? Let me Benji, explain. I will show you. Boys, take this thing and match her like the cockroach that she is. Take her out! Come back here! Come back here! Come back here! Jenny, Alice, you were wonderful. You played your role perfectly well. There was no way he could suspect you. Oh, I'm sorry. Did they hurt you? Oh, don't. I'm sorry. Don't worry. I'll make sure that I get your balance across to you. I'll even pay you extra. Don't mind the guy. He pretends a lot. He just seems nice. He's very stingy. I just had to set him up. You understand? Okay, don't worry. Thank you very much. Okay, all right. I'll call you again tomorrow. Bye bye. Jenny, please, 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 honey, please, please, please. What? You thought you were smart, didn't you? Now you know that I am smarter. Just look at you. Take a look. Take a look, take a look. All you did with that halot is continuing here in print and tape. What did you take me for? Eh? You think I'm some bush illiterate girl? You can just treat any how you like? No way. Benji, no way. I'm an educated woman and I know my rights. I want a divorce. Simple and short. Calm down, man. Calm down. Calm down, please. Calm down. Look, I, I, I swear to God. I hadn't done anything with that girl. 
We are just beginning to know each other. <laughs> Jenny, you know you push me into all this. Hmm? You deny me in bed. You deprive me of the very matrimonial liquor that should be consumed between a husband and a wife. Please, sex maniac. Okay, okay. Let's just leave all that. You know how much I love you. Please don't do this to me. Please. I beg, please. Love Bakuoko. I said I want a divorce. Didn't you hear me? Look, sweethearts, please. I swear to God in heaven, it will never, never happen again. On my honor. Hmm? Look at unfaithful husband talking of honor. Where did you pick it? Eh? You that you left a queen like me at home and you are going around with all these cheap harlots. You are not talking of honor. Please, sweetheart. For me to even Please. consider you and bury this case at all, you have to pay me one million naira. What? I said you pay me one million naira payable into my account first thing on Friday morning. Are you ready to cooperate? Oh, oh. If you like, cooperate. If you like, don't cooperate. The whole world will hear and I will leave you. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. I'll do it. my door at this time of the night. Madam, I'm sick. I'm dying. Madam, please open the door. Please, ma'am. Please. What should we do with the name of this? What is this? Hey. What is it? Oga, where the pepper? What the pepper? I say where the pala pala. Pa pa. What's what are you talking about? Boss, where the 250000 dollars will you keep here? Don't lose. No, there's no money here. Eh? No money. We no. don't have any money. Boss, I beg, help me go bring a call. No money. Please. There's no money. Shut up! Get the money! Fast! Okay. Yes, please, don't shoot. Okay. Thank you. Please, okay, please. Okay. Please, don't just shoot. I'll, I'll, I'll get you the money. Please. Please. Please don't shoot. I'll, I'll, I'll give you whatever you want. Please. 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 Please don't kill us, please. Please, please, please don't kill us. Make you please. 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 Thank you! Oh my god! Thank you! Thank you! Oh god, thank you! Oh, thank you! Thank He was to fly to Hong Kong the very next day. I told the robbers about the money, but I didn't know that he had a gun. And I didn't ask those stupid boys to come brandishing real guns. I thought they would just come, collect the money, I'd get my share, and life would just go on, you know? I wasn't prepared for his death at all. After his burial, I could no longer live in that house. Carol, I, I kept hearing his footsteps all over the house, even his voice, but I managed to cut away a lot of his money and property as much as I could, you know now, but looking back on it, the whole thing, thinking back, I realized that he must have been the prophecy. Carol. My dear. It's about to this. Oh, I don't think. 
Why should it be? Why should it happen to me? Why should it be me? My dear, it's okay. It wasn't your fault, my dear. Your problem can be solved. Oh, yeah, it can. Mm -hmm. How? There's this man of God I found here in Abuja. He's very powerful. I mean, we'll go for deliverance as soon as possible. Deliverance? Mm -hmm. So, what do I tell Senator now? You tell him yes. Yes. My dear, you'll be delivered before the marriage. This man of God, huh, he's very, very powerful. He's the one that destroyed all the charms Bokribo gave to me. Even the ones that were inserted into my body. Really? Yes. He destroyed everything. She, you know, two of us, we've come very close to death. Yes. And if not for God, if not for God, we would have been dead by yes. now. If not for Dr. Adim, I would have been in my grave by now. Eh? And I feel both of us should start a new life totally. And one sure way to start a new life is marriage. Yes. Eh? No, right. look at you now. Eh? You are lucky. At least you have somebody asking you for marriage. What about me? Hmm? Nobody's even asking me whether I did sell or I be at buy. Mm. No, look at me. Am I not a babe? Eh? Nobody's offering me marriage. No man. Don't worry. Ha, don't worry. I believe that God's time is the best. My dear. Mm. God's time is the best. And I know that the right man for you is just around the corner. My dear, let him come out from that corner. I mean, but did they, I need a man now. Babe, eh? finish for where you do. Uh -uh. No, no, see, see. No, no, see me now. You're not cheap. No, you, see you now. Not cheap. Don't worry. When the man comes, you two, you will know that you have found the man. See, Senator, now. Why is all that am I telling all this uh, history, uh, considering him? Is it not because he's rich? Mm -hmm. When man comes, you know that you have found the man. Uh -huh. Not all this cross-eyed, <laughs> cross-legged, <laughs> long neck, ostrich neck, <laughs> poverty stricken things. What do you want to do with them? Mm -hmm. When the man comes, he must be loaded. <laughs> so that you too, you will know that yes, yeah, you, you have found the man. Correct. Yes. Where are you off to? I need to make some urgent deliveries. Deliveries? Mm -hmm. What deliveries? You didn't tell me of any contracts. I need to deliver some human cargoes. Fine boys and fine girls. Oh, I see. I guess I'm out of tune with the trends. Senator is right. I need to retire. I thought we already settled that. I guess so. So what happens to our appointment with the pastor? It's by 5 o'clock now. I'll be back before 5. There's this lady customer of mine that needs company urgently. She's very erratic and queer, but she pays in mint. I mean, she pays very well. That's the name of the game, baby. Cool cash. Correct. You need to see how some of these top politicians' wives, how lonely they are, mm -hmm. and some ugly things they do with these small boys. That's why you should charge them well for supplying them with all those fine, strong boys. And make sure you watch your back and you watch your head in case of trouble though. Trust me now. Uh, trust me. I'll see you. Don't miss me, okay? Okay. <laughs> I'll miss you okay. though. Okay. Bye. I'll be back in five, okay? Come, let me see you. 
exactly my description. <laughs> mm. Isn't Carol wonderful? Hi, darling. My name is Lady Mansion. What's yours? Um, my name is Jane. Oh, such a sweet name for such a queen. Mm. Turn around, turn around. Let me see what's up here. Ooh, that is beautiful. Oh my god. Mm. Oh, come on, baby, give me a hug. You're sweet. Baby. Relax, 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 baby. Eh? Don't be scared. We're going to have such a sweet time together. Mm? Just tell me anything you want. Just name it and it's yours. Tell me, I'll give it to you, okay? Come on, baby. let's do it. Why is what's all this nonsense? What's all this nonsense? Ah, and what's all this nonsense? Ah, don't you know what you're here for? No! Auntie Carol didn't tell me I was coming to sleep with a woman like me. So? Ah, I never spoil it like that. Get out of my house. Just get out! Of course! I'm already leaving! Get out! Ah, what's all this nonsense? I'm going to call Carol. What is all the eh? Hey. Oh. Jenny, I'm home. Jenny. Hello. <laughs> yes, Carol. Save your greetings. What is happening here? What the hell is going on here? Why did you send me one village girl that, that doesn't know what time it is, eh? To come here and insult me and embarrass me? I'm really sorry, Lady Mansion. Eh? I just realized the mistake now. And I was about to correct the mistake when you called. Please, I'm really very, very sorry for the embarrassment. I'm sending the right girl immediately. I am no longer interested, okay? In fact, I am not even in the mood. Return my money at once! No sense. Lady Mansion, say... Hello? You hold me, Lady Mansion. How do you know? My husband does not love me. Uh, he married me for sure. Sure? Yes. <laughs> I'm only useful during parties and outings. My husband made love to me last three months ago. Three months? And it was so obvious that none of us enjoyed it. Uh, he has harem of girlfriends all over the place. Uh, and just two months ago, he impregnated our house girl. Uh -huh. So you see, he has no reason to complain if I have to find my happiness elsewhere. So why don't you leave the marriage instead? Leave the marriage? Yeah, I'm here for you. <laughs> oh my God. <coughs> God forbid. I can't afford to leave the trappings of his office, my dear. Do you know what it means to be the wife of the special advisor to the president? Mama. The glamour. <laughs> My dear, I can't afford to miss all that too. Oh, yeah? Mm. I used to complain, but not anymore. Mm. Not when I can have you all to myself when I need yeah, you. Yeah, for you. Yeah, for you. <laughs> so, I'm so happy. Yeah. So happy. Yeah. Who is that? I'll tell you what it What do you want here? What do you want? Please go away. That is fire in the hotel. <gasps> fire. 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 <laughs> Who the hell are you? I am a private investigator. 
employed by the special advisor to the president on economic affairs, your husband. You see, I was employed to monitor activities and movement like this. I decided to reveal myself to you because I wanted to help you. So, if you are ready to cooperate with me, then let's talk business. Out of your mind. How am I sure you not want cheap blackmail and looking for chop money? 500,000 is what huh? I demand for you. I have a record of all you've been doing with this Chicolo since a lady called Carol brought both of you together. But if you think I'm a cheap black man, then I will be saying goodbye and have a nice day. Stop there. Come back here. Madam, you don't order me around. I only decided to help you. Cut those crabs. What exactly do you want? Are you ready to talk business? Glenn, please excuse us. Please, I want him out of this place. You stay at the lobby. Lisa, for once in my life, I am totally confused about which way forward. I mean, all my dream for Abuja has fallen like a pack of cards. Sophie, there's no need getting confused. When one door closes, another opens. Which other door is there? Which? Huh? Hmm. I was thinking, why don't you join my business, at least for the meantime? Your business? Yes. Quite frankly, I do not understand your business. I don't like getting into something I'm not proficient in. I like to be the master of my own craft. Sophie, you don't need much skill to be in my kind of business. No. All that you need is a smart brain and a smooth-talking tongue. With that, you're ably qualified. And I can see you have that already. So we are game. Well, thanks for the compliment. But you see, coming from all I've achieved before now, I won't settle for less. That's why I'm bothered about the length of time it's going to take to learn the ropes, so make fair. money. This business does not require any length of time. In fact, there's a heavy deal on ground right now. And I can see your position in that deal. Really? Oh, yes. If we land this one, it will fetch us big money. Big money. Money that we can use to buy the latest Jeeps, just like we've always dreamt. Own our own houses. Even travel abroad and live big. Yes. When are we start? Right now, baby. Yes. <laughs> Let me make the call. Okay? <laughs> Right here is the guest wing. You know, if you have guests, you don't need to bother putting them in the main house. They just stay here all by themselves. And you're overlooking the beautiful mountains, the work of nature, which I'm sure sometimes you just look at and enjoy yourself. And you can see, it's been landscaped already. Well, 
So what do you say? It's beautiful. It's exactly what I've been looking for. I told you? Because I know you're a man of class and you like beautiful things. So um, can we get back to the office? Yes, why not? Okay. You lie, you steal, you fight, you kill, pain and sorrow. You live on your Jesus trail. This is obvious, baby. Your heart is <laughs> right. Mr. Woodland, you're back. Welcome, please sit down. Thank you. Do you like the property? Sure, I do. It's beautiful. Good. I'm glad to hear that. You see, we are the leading property agents in the country. We have properties scattered all over the six states of the country. We have property in Abuja here, Asakoro, Wuse, Maitama. You just name it. And our offer is the best. And we don't disappoint big clients like you. That's nice. Mr. Ben, are you through with the papers? I have them here. The deeds, the CFO, are all contained in this file. Good. Beautiful. Beautiful. You can see that the papers are intact and ready. The only thing remaining now is the 75 million naira. Once that is paid, we endorse the papers to be signed and sealed. We shake hands and the property becomes yours. I suggested. 60 million yesterday. Isn't that okay? Come on, Mr. Woodland. 75 million naira converted to dollars is not too much, is it? In fact, one Chinese man came in yesterday and offered 80 million, but I didn't give it to him because of the special interest I have in you. And so I kept the property for you. Once you pay 75 million naira, the deal is sealed. All right. Yes. Let's finish with the check. To who? Chief Mrs. Doris Briggs. Why this place is locked? I want to see estate agent here. There's no estate agent here. No, I was here last week. I I bought the house 75 million naira. From where here? No other place, but I came here. This is the place where I came. <laughs> no, there's no estate agent here. I it's bought house this morning. I went and see bulldozer has demolished my house. <laughs> Everything down. Bulldozer. Okay. You go build the government house where they don't mark with the demolition for a long time. They don't do it for one night. Hmm. This is not hmm. for one night. Just go. Hey, 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 hey. Don't do a scratch your head, man. Get out. 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 Shall conquer. Shall I respect, man? Respect, man. 
Jennifer sees this one, Ooh. she will commit suicide. She's dead already! Somebody! What is happening? Let us pop some wine now! Come on, let me get the wine! Put your hands! King of glory, Father Lord God, whatever spiritual husband that is holding her captive this moment, I declare that power loser. I declare lose in the name of Jesus. I lose her, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Lose. Amen. I say you are free in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Yes, send the Bobosh, Maka send the Bobosh, break his in the Baba, Maka send the Baba, break his in the Baba. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I bless you, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Sister Jenny, the Lord has not given you the spirit of fear, but of power, love, and of sound mind. So you have nothing to fear. As a matter of fact, you can conveniently go ahead and marry whoever you want to marry. But uh, there is something very important that you must uphold. You see, this word of God, it is our strength. I want you to hold firm to the word of God because the devil will always look for a way to get back into your life. But in the name of Jesus, I am persuaded that what happened to you today is permanent in the name of Jesus. Hey, it shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. What the Lord has done for us. It shall be permanent. Oh, it shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. Can you see the 
Yeah. How dare that come to where we shot? For every action. I'm talking to you. Oh, Carol! Did you not see Sophia? Why are both of you following me around? Why are you shopping where I shop? Oh, because you're driving Senator's Jaguar? You think you've arrived? Did you see my Jeep? It's one of my fleets. Old lady, don't be uncharitable. Have you congratulated Sophia, your friend? She got a new Jeep, you know. <laughs> Baby, let me tell you something. It is not enough for you to relocate to Abuja. Aha! Uh -huh. You've got to know what it takes. Really, girl? In case both of you don't know, I am now a born again. Hallelujah! And I will not be drawn into joining issues with occultists and criminals like both of you. You just watch your mouth! I so said that I watch your mouth! So what are you going to do? No, you ask me what I'm going to do! Talk to me! You ask me what I'm going to do! No, 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 stop that! You ask me what I'm going to do! This time around, I will cut off that your caustic tongue, squeeze it in the mud, and make you eat it. Jenny, you think here is Lagos? Remember what the pastor told you. Pastor. Remember. Hmm? Hmm. Just leave them alone. Leave this bunch of... Just leave them alone. Let's go. Anyway, what? Anyway, what? I am getting married. Hey! I will not join issues with misguided criminals like you. Oh, Jennifer, you think you're well guarded? Because you're getting married to an old cargo? You think you've arrived? I ask you? Listen, Sophia, let me tell you. <laughs> this time around, I am getting married. Oh. And there is nothing you can do about it. Really? <laughs> well, old cargo to old cargo. You know what? <laughs> A chameleon can never stop being a chameleon. I believe that soon she will kill the old man and marry the son. Of course. <laughs> Go and pop it and make your own money, baby. Let's go shopping, Gina. Images for the past one week. I thought all this belongs to the past. I must see Pastor Kelly first thing tomorrow morning. What is happening? everybody to night vision but I sneaked out to go enjoy myself and here I am now come on lady come come let's go enjoy ourselves huh come on come come no! 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 What is wrong? Why are you looking so 
so terrified. Which man? It wasn't around. Did you see? Well, I didn't see anybody. There's nobody there. sent me to you. He said to tell you that no one, no one abandons him and sleeps well. Nobody. But how come you suddenly forgot where you started? How come? What nonsense are you talking about? I said I no longer want his powers. I don't want his money. I don't want anything to do with him. Even you! You hear me? You lie. <laughs> Otitibu has made so much commitment for your sake. So much. And you can't abandon him now. No way. Now listen to me. But the boss said to tell you that you must see him urgently. Urgently is the word. No way! No way! Listen to me. Tell him I have nothing to do with him. Nothing! What if I have here? Now is my power. It's my new life, you hear me? Go tell him that since you're his messenger. Just go away! I will. Without pleasure, I will go tell him. So, have you gone nuts or something's wrong with you? Have you gone nuts? There is nobody there. Who are you talking to? Oh my God, something is wrong. Sophia, let's go. Now. This is Abuja and not Lagos. Nothing pursues anybody in Abuja. Let's go. Let's go. Now's the time to fall in love. 
The summer time has come, oh yeah. Now's the time to sail, yeah. Now's the time to fall in love. Now's the time to fall in love. And now the sun is shining, uh -huh. and the skies are blue, oh honey. I know you love me. I heavens only knows I love you too. There's been a mystery, but now it's clear to me. Now's the time to fall in love. Now's the time to fall in love. Thank you, baby. Play me another one, Senator. No, 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 no. No, you see, this song, I want to perfect it. Because I want to sing it live on our wedding day next week. Ooh, that's yes. going to be beautiful. Yes. I can just see the beautiful day next week. Yes. Now see how it starts. No, 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 no. no. I want you to drink to it. Drink to it. Mm. Okay, so <coughs> are you right? Uh, yes, yes. Okay. <coughs> Maybe another one? <coughs> yes, yes. Okay. Are you okay? <coughs> are you alright, Senator? Senator, are you okay? Senator, what is this? <laughs> Senator, are you all right? Oh my God! What's the meaning of this? Senator! Senator! Oh my God, what's the meaning of this? Senator! Joseph! Joseph! Oh. Senator! What's wrong? What's happening? What's happening? Senator! Senator! What's wrong? Lift him up! What's happening? connection between the print they had and this present unconscious situation. Every test that has been conducted so far is negative for any sort of poison. And it is very unusual. I mean, he's been unconscious now for three days. So is there anything else that happened that you may want to tell me, madam? Nothing else, doctor. Absolutely nothing. Doctor, I told you. We were just sitting down, discussing our wedding. Then, I gave him a little wine. I also drank from that glass of wine. Doctor, please help me. It's okay, Doctor, it's okay. Please it's okay. Help relax. Me. Calm down. Calm down, okay? You see, we are still working around the clock to make sure that he comes around pretty soon. Okay? Just relax. Relax. I'll be in my office. Excuse me.
Hello, is that Carol? Yes! This is Carol! Carol or Culture Talking! I said, have you seen my cobra? You and Sophia, you have conspired to, to steal my cobra! A mad woman! You are a mad woman, Jennifer! You are an idiot, a stupid fool! Look at, look at, look at, look at you! Fool! Keep on running, 
No, you can't run no way from yourself. Cobra, have you seen my cobra? Cobra. 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 Hey, you! Foolish man, are you, are you not supposed to answer me? Did you hear me call cobra three times? Did you hear me call cobra three times? Foolish, foolish man. You don't know that when you hear cobra, you answer me. Look at beautiful girl. You take me to your house. Marry me. Just your wife and well your children. You don't know. Give me all your money. Look at, look at, they're not talking. Foolish, foolish, look at. Mm. Mm. What's hidden in the dark? 